and we're gonna do Animus Major, and I think Animus is a certain amount of favor, right? Let me look at the spreadsheet. Oh, HP, you have to be above 50 HP. We're gonna be classic guy for that. And we're going Volcano Temple. Hey, Bloopy. Out. Hey, little nugget. Hey, Taz. Just fiction. gonna steal his shotgun back. Goodness, the moles today. Uh oh. <laughs> Gonna get a shotgun. Oh. Okay, we're almost dead. Uh, yeah. Welcome back, everyone. Gonna turn that off. Okay, 2 HP. We're good. We're good. Just gotta dodge the shopkeeper here. And get the Ujat. Those moles were taking me out. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> That was close to angering him. Uh, yeah, there's no altar, so we're good. Hey, Sorty. Hey, Kai Wolf. Alright, here's what we're going to do. We're going to wait until he's all the way to the left and then just try to book it. There we go. Perfect. Now we're forgiven and we're going Volcana Temple. So, we're going to get the Alien Compass. Nothing horrible happens on 2-1. Yeah, me too. I'm loving the power pack. And there's different routes you can go for it, which really um, really makes it fun for a game like Spelunky, depending on what you get in the black market. Bashi, I was thinking about doing that tomorrow, actually, if I feel like it. The bosses are super hard, so I can only, I have to take it like one day at a time, but we'll beat it. I will become the Bashi eventually.
We got horsing. Uh, there might be something there, but we can just check from Sparrow over here. I guess that wasn't very helpful. We spent a rope to get a rope. We're not gonna kill her though. Hey, Tic Tac Foe, thanks. Probably just over here. Crates, maybe. paste already. Uh, we haven't gotten the item from the altar because I don't think we've seen an altar yet. Oh, speaking of which... Hoping for climbing gloves, of course. Since we're going Volcana Temple, we can do the skip easily with climbing gloves. And, uh, I'm going to not sacrifice Percy yet. I want to buy these items first, so I have a better chance at climbing gloves from the altar. Okay, okay. And yeah, we're done with 2 2, I think. Hey, Prenus. Oh, did I say Percy? Yeah, I meant Poochie. Yeah, we should check before activating it. If I don't have a ton of ropes, I don't like checking because uh, then you spend all of your ropes, right? There we go. Okay, no altars, no shops, we're good. Six HP at least going into the next level. Unless we get bodied in Vlad's castle. Waiting for the lava drips down here. I think we're done. So we can just go for it. There we go. I think I am going to try to carry all of the hired help with me to the next level. Yes. 
That way, if there's an altar, we can get a lot of HP and... Uh, the Kapal. Let's see how many of them survive. Oh wait, there might be something over here, like a ton shop. Oh, it looks like all of them didn't jump in the spikes. None of them did. Okay. Let's keep going. I wonder, do I have the damsels all on hamsters? Maybe. No, it's on variety. We've just seen a lot of hamsters. Alter, maybe? Don't do it. Okay. Hey, Bumper. Do it for the hamster. Hey, Palio. Thanks for the bits, by the way. Hey, Eden. Is this? Yeah, I definitely messed up my mic position. It's not a huge deal. Okay. Uh, so I think... You know what? I don't think hired help go with you into the duet if we're going there. Kind of freaked me out there. I meant to crush it. Hamster. Hey, Kai Wolf. Thank you for the hamster. Hey, sticks. Hey, spooked. Hey, oak. And we could leave Vlad's cape in here when we go to the temple. But you do get a jetpack now in the duat. Yeah, I think I'll just take the jetpack. Why not? And we can do another chilling attempt if we go to the, du uh, the duat here. Because I still haven't learned the bubble skip, so I can't I can't do the six four skip exactly.
the duet being added to the cosmic ocean. Yeah, that'd be cool. I guess the duet and the city of gold are really the only tile set that aren't in the cosmic ocean, but the city of gold is just like a normal temple with like a gold shader. So I think it's cool that the duet is like super special. Uh, I've played a... Yeah, i played Bloons Tower Defense in school, in like junior high. Flash games. Not any of the new ones, though. Actually, I am going to leave Lad's Cape. Because we don't actually... People don't redeem Volcana very often for the daily lately. Oh, I kind of needed that... Those ropes. Should I make the drop of faith? Okay, we're fine. AU, okay. Yeah, I think it would be cool if the duet was in the Cosmic Ocean, but I also think it's cool that it's super unique to like what that one level. There we go, that's a little bit better. Okay, guys. Just wait right there for me. That's an easy horsing. Oh, wait. Okay, there's climbing gloves, so we can do the 6 4 skip. Uh. So we're not gonna have to go to the duet. Unless we wanted to. I don't know why I set this guy free. Wasn't the best idea. But we got him. I do want to go into the city of gold at least so we can get uh, all of this jelly. Okay, there's the opening. We do have all these hired help. Hey, wait. Since we got a plasma cannon right here, we can just... We can blow up the city of gold. Why not? Uh, I do kind of need to secure my hired help, though. They're all sleeping. But yeah, let's... Let's look for a safe spot. Oh. I don't have any mobility, though. I kind of... Dropped off Vlad's cape, so... I don't know about this. That was a bad bomb. I don't have pitcher's mitt. Okay. That should work, though. Hey, Jinkies. Hey, Volker. Oh, don't do that. Just relax. Uh-oh. Okay, I can use my plasma cannon a little bit here. Oh, 
city of gold entrance. get these guys to come down with us. Oh, they're all stuck. Oh wait, we don't need these guys anymore. That's right. Well, we don't need them to carry any items. Uh, all right, let's go. Now we can get the Kapala. Watch him shoot the altar. Oh, oh he almost whipped me onto the altar. Okay, we're good. Finally have the Kapala. Oh, don't get crushed. Oops. That really hit us? Okay. Let's be a little bit more careful. Hopefully this is a jelly. Oh, we just... Okay. We made her angry, so it's not going to be the jelly. Let's see. We can get some blood over here. Maybe. I don't know how much I'm actually going to ghost, if anything. Because I don't have any mobility. Maybe we can just get some gems. That's right, we can, uh, we can farm a mummy a little bit. Oh. Hello. I don't know where this guy came from. Hey, decaf. Hey, worm bob. There we go. That's better. Yeah, I didn't think there would be climbing gloves in the temple, so I put away my cape. Because I wanted to keep my cape after the duat. After going into the duat. And then we just happened to get a plasma cannon. If I had like 20 ropes, I would try to ghost this. Even without any mobility, but yeah. We don't even have spring boots. I 
I'm gonna blow up as much as I can, though. That's always fun. Okay, Ghost is here. Oh, that was close. Leprechauns. Oh. Sacrificed. Almost. Okay, we're alive. I swear. Getting sacrificed in the City of Gold is... It's always entertaining, at least, right? We're good, though. We're fine. Alright. That's weird, Twig. Uh, not Twig. Decaf. I have heard in the latest patch, Blue actually had a cursed cat drop a diamond so i feel like they added a couple of those uh diamond drops to enemies hey 9x 9x and sun Oh, I didn't keep a hired help alive, so we're not going to be able to bring this into the cosmic ocean. Um, because there's no hired help on the dailies, like in the normal spots. There's no coffins on the daily, except for in uh, Vlad's castle. Oh, that was almost cursed. This is an Echoes level, isn't it? Maybe it's just a dark level, but it certainly feels like it. That was close to being cursed, also. Hey, Lakitu. Hey, C-Pep. Okay, so I do have Vlad's cape. I was expecting to go to the duat, because uh, otherwise I wouldn't have been able to do the 6-4 skip. Because I still haven't learned bubble strats. Yeah, let's get the cape first.
Well, hey Shindig. Hey, not even live. Uh, well, the jetpack is good, but Vlad's cape doesn't blow up. So. That's why I store it sometimes. I was just gonna go for the jetpack. Then I thought the dailies, people have been redeeming the jungle a lot, so we don't actually get to see Vlad's cape a ton. Hey, Kekko. So one of the challenges for this daily was major, which is a million, but that's... Uh, it's easy to get if you make it all the way to 799. There we go, that's what I wanted. That lava's gonna be overflowing soon. Let me just grab this crate. There we go, worth. Okay. What's the best item for no gold runs? That's a good question because for no gold runs, you really don't want to be blowing up um, like crust and stuff. I, obviously a jetpack because you can just hover over everything, but Yeah, so for the non-Cosmic Ocean stuff, just a jetpack would do fine. I think jetpack, matic, and spectacles, so you can see everything in the crust, is a good idea. Or the Ujai. Oh dear. Alright. Should we do tusks? Yeah, let's do tusks. Since we already have a plasma cannon, we brought it. Projectile Poochie. Hey, Matthew, thank you so much for the five months. You got a friend in me, Milkman. You know, Toy Story was my favorite movie when I was a kid. The first two. And I think it's cool because my nephew loves Toy Story 3 and 4. He thinks the first one is uh, creepy, which uh, I totally agree with, actually. I think a lot of it does have to do with the story that's just creepy, but it's also because it's one of the first 3D animated films. So like some of the just 3D animations are a little bit creepy. But I think that's what intrigued me as a kid. I kind of liked creepy stuff. Come 
or bud. Buster. Wait. I didn't hear him die. I feel like he's still up there. Oh, yeah, there he is. Okay. Now we killed him. Oh, you know what? Let's get the monkey. So he can be pooping while we're doing everything else on this level. Hey, egg. Thanks. Yeah, so, um, if you didn't read the patch notes, they did patch out the, the monkey poop exploit. Which is good. The infinite pooping is good. That they patched out. I'm kind of sad that they patched out the quick pooping method, though. It was really convenient to get all the poop out of them. Yeah. Uh, let's go get plasma cannon. Wow. Alright, guess we're not ghosting this. I was getting really greedy with my bombs. Didn't want to use a single bomb. Oh, this guy's gonna kill himself. I'm kind of curious how much it is unghosted, anyway. And with the monkey. But we can get more favor, though. the monkey poops. One. Hey, blue. There's one, two, three. Got these guys left. Hey, dreamski. guys left. I'm just waiting for the monkey to be done pooping. is a bit higher than that. Oh, there's horsing. Okay, let's see. It should be 30k or more. Well, to be fair, we did collect a little bit before that. So it was probably like 25k. Oh, we don't even have a way to the door yet. Okay. Horsing was there because we, um, we did the alien compass route. Why did I get the golden monkey? I just wanted to. I just wanted to see how much it was worth without the exploit. Also, this is a daily, so I'm not really going for score.
Um, and also, I didn't ghost tusks. So it was only like 100k that level. You know, I think it would be a good idea to learn the bubble skip just for the dailies when we have to go Volcano Temple and we don't have climbing gloves. That would have been an unfortunate fall damage death. Here's my plasma cannon though. Bruh. Um, the mini game, I don't think any secrets have been found. I think it's just a, a little incentive to get you to watch the credits, which is pretty cool. Hey, Yardy. Hey, Wilbur. Sneaky Pete. A GoPo. Uh, the water saves you, but if you go straight down, you uh, get hit, or you hit her, like, the platforms below there. So you take infinite fall damage if there's not bubbles. It's not bubbles. You can bomb the... So you can bomb the spark traps, but you can't bomb the force fields. The horizontal ones. Bye bye plasma. Wow, this would be so cool on a speed run right here. Having the cat right next to the altar. Alright, we have to do it. Since it's so close. Actually, that's the perfect spot for him to poop. Now I kind of want to wait out his poop completely just to see how much I get. Although, I think he takes a bit longer than a minute. Hey, Jim. Hey, Lava. Could be a caveman shop. Worth. Uh, let's try to get the monkey. I don't think he's done pooping though, so. That's going to kill us.
Uh-oh. Yeah, he's 100% not done pooping. Might have killed myself. But it was worth it. Just to see the monkey. Um, Hyper... Hyper Metra, thank you for the Twitch Prime. And... Among, Among is boosted. Thank you for the three months. Thank you for the support, guys. Hey, congrats, zombie. Among Us is boosted. Ah, rip. Little nugget. What's the goal? So, the route for the daily that was redeemed was Volcana Temple and uh, Animus Major, which means we get to 799 and we have more than 50 HP and we have more than a million. Which are both not too difficult with Vlad's Cave. Well, the HP is not too difficult, and then the million isn't too difficult. Just collecting gold. Anytime you see uh, a very questionable donation, it's usually from boobs. Usually from the same guy. For example, the other day we got a donation, a $1 donation, that said something like, I slurped diarrhea. That was from boobs. Hey, Blabulb. Thank you for the four months. Good luck on your runs. Yeah, thanks. Thank you for the support. Uh, I kind of wasn't looking. Arrow traps are upside down in Sunken City, so it's hard. Oh, I got the whip off there. Let's see. Is the damsel dead? Hopefully not, because this is 7-3. Might be in a back layer. Oh, there you are. Okay, Poochie. Gucci saved us. We'll be fine. Let's see. Uh. Yeah. Let's go. Hunt on time. Whoa. Um. Chili Steak, thank you for the Twitch Prime, and thank you for the 20 gift subs, Anonymous. I really appreciate the support. Hope you're having a great stream and even better runs. Much love from Canada and my biggest inspiration to this hard game. Yeah, thank you. And Miss Miranda, thank you for all the support, or thank you for all the company over the last several months, Twig. And thank you for the support. I appreciate it.
Um, yeah, thanks again, Anonymous. Hey, sir, co-op. And thank you for the hype train, everyone. If you just got here, we're on the daily. We're doing... Or we did Volcana Temple, which means we have the alien compass. And... We uh, are trying to get... We're trying to finish 799 with over 50 HP. And also finish with over a million gold. The million gold will be easy if we make it to 799. And then the HP will probably be easy unless we get poisoned. But that being said, we do have Vlad's Cape, so even then, I don't think it'll be a huge issue. Hey, Tay Grace, thank you for the three months. Kai Wolf, thank you for the bits. Bumper, thank you for the bits. And Two Cone, wow. Thank you, everyone. Yeah, no problem, Jazz. I just... Or I started the daily really early today compared to most days. Um, I usually don't start streaming this early. And then we started the daily... Like, right off the bat, so... Hey, lasagna. Thank you for the two months. Jinkies, thank you for the 100 bits. Boobs, there you are. Thank you for the dollar. And anonymous, thank you for the bits. Blue Phoenix. Thanks, everyone. Happy Sunday. Yeah, wow, this is unexpected. But thank you. Really means a lot. There's some arrows in the loop. of these recent dailies i've been trying to go for like weird challenges so we haven't actually finished a daily and it's been a hot minute uh, so i think we'll just take this one and try to finish it uh if we can sorty says i love most of you <laughs> Yeah, thanks again, guys. Means a lot. Hamster. Hamster. And I know, um, a lot of people like watching the YouTube dailies, like when they're falling asleep, so. I think it's fun to do a, a relaxing CO run every once in a while, where I'm not going super fast or I'm not trying any weird challenges that make it short, you know? Hamster. Okay, pretty straightforward on this level. In fact, we could just use the loop here. Hey Adam, thank you for the gift sub.
Oh yeah, I guess the stream didn't show boobs donation until later on. Because of the... The hype train. Hey, Fishian. Oh, that's true, you know. I was thinking... I'm going to change... Since they allow character mods, I think I'm going to change the... Classic guy's volume, or the classic guy's jump sound, because it can be kind of uh, irritating after a while. Hey, Dreamski. <laughs> Thank you for the gift sub to Pokimane. Welcome. Oh, I guess that was the second one. I think also the dailies where I'm not doing um, any sort of super hard challenge are good to learn from. Even if I don't make it all the way, uh, you can just watch my mistakes. And this is the perfect time to use a camera because I haven't been using them on speed runs or score runs. But if you just want to finish the Cosmic Ocean, using a camera is actually really helpful. Okay, last door is probably upper left. Maybe on the very bottom that we don't really have access to without using a couple ropes. That could be the case. Or to the left of the jelly over here, yeah. Yeah, the camera, so it, it's a ranged weapon, first of all. Um, second of all, you can use it through tiles, right? It insta-kills a lot of the, uh, like, annoying movement enemies. For example, mosquitoes, maggots, bats. And it stuns almost every other enemy. Hey, Eden. Twig, you can try Lola's kibble, just don't eat too much. Yeah, I don't... I don't plan on, you know, eating it like cereal or anything. I was just gonna take a couple of pieces. Hey, Blooper. Or Bloopy. Thank you for the gift sub. It also makes UFOs fall straight down. Or almost straight down. Doesn't have any interactions with the orbs, though. Hey, Wumbo Dumbo, thank you for the Twitch Prime, the two months. I appreciate the support. Hey, Dosting. Hey, kid eating a fish. Camera also breaks up the Olmec. Or the Olmite um, pyramids. Olmite stacks. Which can be helpful, I guess, if it 
they're in a weird spot. Oh, it also sets off arrow traps safely. So you don't have to use resources. I still think that it should one-shot these guys, these traps, since they're skeleton traps. Hamster. Okay. Let's see, is there a good way to go to the door here? I think that's an easy usage of the loop. Or a good usage. Hey, Brotato. Uh, I don't have a verified Twitch account and can't verify it. Verify it. It's a long, dumb story, but thanks for the many hours of entertainment and thanks for the gift sub. I've been looking for months, lol. Your first win in Cosmic Ocean was amazing. I had all my coworkers gathering around to watch it. They had no idea what was going on, but they knew how hype I was. Hey, thank you so much, Brotato. That's awesome. Oh, the camera can also stun um, angry crocmen. So, like, if the crocmen are jumping around, you can stop them, which is super important in the cosmic ocean. Can also kill the cursed cats, although the dust still disperses, so you have to be careful. Hey, Bulwa Wayne Kenobi. Thank you for the Twitch Prime. Yeah, sure, Sorty. Since I upped the price to 20k, I sort of opened up the daily to any challenge. Like, you can request anything, and I'll go for it. Just might not last long, though. Hamster. Hey, Anonymous, thank you for the 69 bits. Oh, you know what? That was a bad bomb. Because there's a bunch of mines laying around, so you can save resources there. What run am I doing? This is the daily and Volcana Temple. Well, if I have the alien compass, you can always tell it's Volcana Temple.
And if we get spring boots, that'd be cool, but we can still do it without it. Hey, Laurel. Hey, hammy boy. Yeah, same here, Will. Um, the alien compass helps for more than just pointing to the door. It helps you uh, anchor yourself where you are on the level. And it took me a while to figure that out, like how to use the alien compass proficiently. Hey, Alex. So this is not the best. Um, sticky bombs stick to the orbs as of last patch. The patch before last patch, two patches ago. I've been YOLOing it on speedruns so often in the temple, I kind of forgot how to play it safely. Just use a lot of resources, I guess. You know, this might not be worth it, but I'm like 99% sure you can do this safely without dying there. True, Matthew. <laughs> oh, yeah, I put, yeah. E pad, PlayStation controller. There's actually a really cool feature in Overlunky that shows you, um, pretty sure you can do that safely. That shows you the hitboxes and you would be surprised at how small the hitbox is on the jellyfish. Door. Or uh, last orb. That's what I'm looking for. Oh, there it is. Maybe I didn't see it because it was behind debris. Hey, Skeeter Drums, thanks. Yeah, camera doesn't break. This is why I'm carrying a camera around. Because it can do things like that. It can kill the little skulls from the witch doctors. Thank <laughs> you. 
It's not the fastest item, so I don't use it on the speedruns I've been doing, but... This is a daily, so we're... Taking it chill. Oi, oi. Hey, Snowy. Jungles are really blocked off sometimes. That was where we came from. Let's check on this side. Oh, I guess we did. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Uh, what was running through your mind during the 790s of your 10 mil score run? Good question. Mainly, I was just trying to finish. Like, once we got the 10 mil, I was like, okay, let's just get the orbs and leave, mainly. I collected a couple gems here and there. But on the last 10 levels, I think I didn't even have the time jelly spawn. Because I didn't want, you know, to risk anything. Hey, Alatar. Thanks. Hey, congrats, Alex. Saw an orb over there to the very left. Didn't do that for safety. Ping pong. Pinball. Last one. Maybe over here. I'm killing these horse guys because apparently diamonds can drop from them now. Where did I not check? Right there, I guess. <laughs> okay, he's crushed. That's a good opportunity to use that mechanic. Hey, J Farbs, thank you for the three months. I appreciate the support. Hey, Abigail. Hey. 
I wonder if you have something in your hand, if you have pitcher's mitt and a skeleton or a skull falls on you, do you still get hurt? Because usually if you're not holding anything, you would catch it with the pitcher's mitt. I feel like you would still get hurt. Because I was holding the camera there. There it is. Oh, whoops. I, w I wanted to do something cool by throwing the paste bomb past the jellyfish onto the orb, but yeah. It does stick to items in this game. Haste bombs. Camera, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Camera insta kills the maggots. With Vlad's cape, you don't really need to do much to get to 99 HP if you're, you know, just collecting the blood from uh, enemies that you kill. If we get a metal shield, I think I'll carry that around. I don't think I've ever finished a CO run with a metal shield. And for some reason, people love seeing the metal shield in action. In action. Okay, last orb's right over here. Why did that guy flip? Maybe to avoid the spikes? I feel like they usually only flip when they're above you. Or below you.
I'm gonna keep killing these guys. I wanna see diamond drop from them. We got a bouncer. Sorry, dude. Hey, Petropolis. Metal shield, maybe? Anyone know the drop rate for the metal shield from those guys? I feel like it might be 10%. That's just a total guess though. is the new patch going to release? Uh, they released a new patch last week. If you're talking about PS4, I have no idea. Usually PS4 gets patches a couple weeks later. Hey, poison type. Okay. Speaking of poison... Okay, we're fine. We're gonna be fine. Okay, just... Just... I wanted my camera back. Like I said, nice little relaxing cosmic ocean here. The average temple level? True, true. Agreed. sometimes think that I can hear the orbs, but whenever I look up or down, it's never there. Okay, there's an orb. Hello. Hey, Ran. Hey, Rando. Oh. I like power pack runs. You know, if I had spring boots, I might actually switch it out. Wait. I think the power pack actually does affect the camera. Oh yeah, definitely affects the camera here.
Still opening crates because I want those spring boots. Web gun. Web gun has its uses. I'll admit it. But they're not a lot of uses. metal shield again. Like I said, I think that would be fun to use. If this kills us, it kills us. Is that a good way to look at life? If it kills us, it kills us? I don't think so, actually. Probably, probably a really bad way to look at it, actually. Sorry, bud. Nice. That reminds me. When I was in the sixth grade, we had, um, we had like the school nurse come by and it was like, during the uh, say no to smoking and alcohol campaign that they did every year, you know, in junior high, middle school. And uh, there's some chemical that's in like nicotine cigarettes that they also use to uh, preserve dead pigs or something. So the nurse would always come by every year with like a, a bag and there'd be a dead baby pig in it. And it would have like, you know, that chemical. And she'd be like, this is what you're smoking, right? And then at the end, she would say, so who's going to try cigarettes? Nobody's going to try it, right? Uh, but this one girl was like, yeah, I think I'll try it. And then she's like, and the nurse is like, why? I just explained why it's so bad. And she's like, well, you know, if, if I like it, you know, I'll keep smoking. But I just want to try it. So... Didn't exactly work on her. And of course, we're in sixth grade, so most of the kids are like, Ew. I'll never try it. That's gross. Okay. 
still want spring boots. Ow. Better now than when we're running away from the jellyfish, though. Do you think she did try it? Um, yeah, I think she got into way worse stuff than that. Because I think when I was in, like, ninth grade, she was doing drugs, so... At least she was consistent. We almost already have a million. Yeah, exactly, Lava. I don't think- I'm pretty sure there's studies about this, but I don't think, like, scaring children like that has as big of an influence on whether they're gonna do drugs or drink as, like, uh, peer pressure does or, like, family influence, you know? That has a lot more weight to it, to the decision. Confirm dare did not work as intended for me. Yep. Okay, temple. Case in point, we also watched, uh, like, almost every year, we watched Super Size Me with the McDonald's guy, you know? Um, but I love McDonald's, and I go there, and I love their food. So that didn't work either. What? Egg, you're not a loser. You're great. Hey, Trayvon. I know. You know what's funny? I... Speaking of those scare ads... I see those, um... Like the, the anti-vape ads on Twitch all the time. Vaping can cause metals to be inhaled into your lungs. Bring it on. I'm already a cyborg.
Oh, little bop there. Ow. We watched that in health class this year, and at some point, the teacher mentioned 600 pound wife at TV show or something. And my friend thought it was the funniest stuff ever. Nice. Okay, if I get... If I get spring boots, I will take a power pack if we keep finding them. Hey, cheese it Oh, that, speaking of being uh, peer pressured, my brother, um, when he was a toddler, you know how parents ask, if your friend jumped off a bridge, you wouldn't do it as well, would you? And my brother said, yes. My mom tells that story all the time. I mean, if you want to be a good friend, you you would do it with him, right? That's what it means to be a friend. Hey, Shula Dane, thank you so much for the six months. Half a year of mini heart attack and giggles. Shula Heart. I appreciate the support. And... You have a golden idol. One, one, two, three. Oh yeah, let's check for uh, metal shield here. There are any crab men. Doesn't look like it. This is a pretty small level. some on this level. the metal shields. Ah, 
Oh, that's still wooden. Dang. No, let me go up there. You know what? I I don't know if you can get a metal shield in a crate. I don't think you can. Uh, do any of your family members watch your stream? Yeah, my brother does. Sometimes he's a mod and my nephew does. My brother's son. Sometimes. He's three, so they watch it together sometimes. Wouldn't be surprised if they would insta-kill you somehow if they came out of a crate. True. That would be something that would happen. I never thought about that. That you can't get a... That's interesting. Should I take the shotgun? I feel like taking the shotgun in case I get a spring boots power pack. Exactly, lava. That's the funnest part. They'll do it right now. See, we have a little... Little flying bullets. Oh, okay, well... Oh, wait, stop, stop. Don't combo me into the lava, though. I was joking. It was for the meme. <laughs> okay. We're fine, we're fine. I thought it was going to keep hitting me. Alright. Can kill those sorceresses. Right from there. Pretty calm temple level. Why is there no face palm emote? There's a couple emotes I want. I want like a thinking emote. I want a face palm emote. Um, I want a monk it emote. That'd be cool. I mean, I'd have to replace some emotes, but yeah, I have a couple of emotes I want to replace that are just like sprites from the game. Still no metal shield. This one's got to have it. Nope. 
Oh, what's that? That's random. I'll take it. This one, though. I believe. I thought that was going to stun me for a second. I like drawing thinking faces. Okay, that could be something. Do spike shoes affect running on treadmills and also did I use effect properly? Um, I don't know if you used effect properly. I feel like in that case it would be effect. But I'm bad at at telling. Okay. Oh, it was correct. Nice. What do I want a shield for? Uh, I've never completed a CO run with the shield, so I thought it would be fun. And also, I don't use it very often either. These are pretty calm temple levels. Hey, Dylal. Yeah, happy Sunday. Hmm. I see. Effects are environmental. Effects are conditional. Hey, Darker Turbo. Do you like risottos? Uh, I don't know what that is. I'm gonna look it up to see if I recognize it. Northern Italian rice dish cooked with broth until it reaches a creamy consistency. Looks yummy. I might have had it before. There's a bomb bag. Hey Griffin. Hey Rocket Chip. Hey Outlaws. Hey Pen IRL. in the wall I saw to the left. What? Oh, 
That guy might have actually saved us there. No joke. But yeah, of course there's a uh, boomerang guy on the door tile that's completely invisible. Classic. Okay, we can leave our shotgun for now. I think we'll find a shield eventually, right? Whoops. Missed the door. Monkey saved us. Never punished? You're crazy. But true. Yeah, I'm sure all, most people feel this way, but sometimes I'm not pun punished when I should be, and then, of course, you get spelunked a lot. Even if you play it perfectly. Yeah, I could have saved some ropes there, but I was lazy. Hey, we're halfway there. Can I get that crate? Without releasing lava? Um, I think so. Just in case, though. Okay, perfect. Not worth. The Wallies can drop the shield. True. I forgot about that. Hey, Toasty. Hey, I Banner. Can you please tell me how many hours are estimated? To complete your first 7.99 run, uh, that depends on a lot of things. I think, like if you have experience with the first game, um, if you go into the game like spoiler free, or if you've watched a lot of it, your experience with other platforming games. But I will say, if you care enough to get for it, I think anyone can get it, even if you don't play a lot of platforming games if you just keep playing the game and uh, keep getting better. Wig, I was thinking maybe we could get an emote of NECA's feet. Man, I'm tempted to unmod. I should mod crosscut. But then I'm afraid he'll say something equally as repugnant. <laughs> okay. Let's get the, the orbs here. Not this time. Actually, though, we did get almost killed by that. Even after death, they still get you. I'm not dead yet. Not yet. Well, Lava, the thing is, I'm not a mod in your chat, so I can troll you. Um, total hours of Spelunky played combined? Probably like 
3,000. The first and the second game. Or more. I didn't play much classic though, so... Don't have very many hours in that at all. That's one... Oh, this level's looking kind of nasty. Oh! That was so close. When do you think Xbox will get Spelunky? I have no idea if that's even on the uh, the menu. Switch is getting the first and second game uh, this summer. Neka's feet would be the perfect emote to represent the metaphorical distances Wiggle has gone to reach his skill level. A very respectable emote, IMO. That's one way to look at it. Yeah, I think Spelunky HD was an Xbox 360 exclusive for a year before coming to Steam on, like, the, the Xbox 360 arcade. That's two. Terrified of jungle levels. Hey, XK. This one isn't going to be a sub one? I suppose not. I'm kind of surprised we're not poisoned. Usually if you go this slow... You get poisoned somewhere along the way. If we could just get that orb without triggering anything. Or get these last two orbs. Hey Smizzler, thank you for the gift sub. I will read that in a second, Kai. Oh. Oh, it's going to do the loop-de-loop. -loop. Okay. Nice. Um, if Olmec had feet, what do you think they'd look like? Would they just stick out of his neck, or would they have legs sticking out of the neck, then feet? Well, I think he would, I think it would just be the feet. Like, really big, fat feet. Kind of like Olmites, right? Olmites are sort of like Olmecs, but brainy. Well, I'm eating. Do you mind? Yeah. Sorry. Although it was Lava who brought up the feet thing. Hey, Lola. So blame him. Hey. Hey, Lava. If it's... If you make it and it's quality enough... I'll add it. If it's 
high enough quality. Poison. There's nothing on the door. Okay. Hey, Jesse. <laughs> Thank you for the four months. Lava, why are you like this? Wouldn't have it any other way. Yeah, that Kirby picture is disturbing, but there was effort put into it, so A+. Plus. Let me clear my queue really quick. There we go. Hey, Cuddles. you feel about a courage emote yeah I, I would like a courage emote it would have to be uh transformative though i think um yoshis are born wearing boots implying that their feet just look like boots i can see that Gonna get the crate. Devin. Do I prefer Vlad's cape or jetpack in Cosmic Ocean? Uh, Vlad's cape for survivability and consistency, and then jetpack for going fast. Or jetpack if you go jungle. You think a bird with human arms for wings or a snake with human legs would win in a fight? The bird is a hawk and the snake is a cobra? Um, I mean, if the bird still has a beak, right? I can just pick up the snake by the tail still, drop it from a thousand feet.
Not good enough, Lava. Needs to be better than that. <laughs> better than I expected, though. Have you made it? Okay. It's not bad, but it's... Yeah, I can't add it. I'm sorry. Not with a good conscience. Conscience. Baba or Bowie? I'm gonna say Baba. what I get for posting that Mario Sonic video in Lava's chat. He's turned my chat into feet. Uh, let me get that. And then I'm still looking for a metal shield because I thought it would be fun. But I've killed so many crab men without finding it. By the way, I still stand by that video is an actual artistic masterpiece. It was done on paper, and uh, it's at a pretty high frame rate. A lot of effort went into it. Eating a burger with no honey mustard. Oh, I actually haven't played Baba as you. Um, I'm not good at those puzzle games, but that one looks fun. I think one of the only, like, super hard puzzle games that I've ever beaten without looking up spoilers is, uh, Braid. Took, like, some of those puzzles took me a long time, but... Uh, I did complete that one. And then I started on The Witness, but... Those puzzles are super hard at a certain point in the game. If you stop playing The Witness for like two days, you forget everything? Exactly. That is so true. That's with a, a lot of puzzle games, I think, but especially The Witness. I've actually tried it, speaking of which, I've tried it multiple times, but I have given up at a certain point every time. Maybe one day I'll go back and complete it. That bomb box was nice. You know what? That reminds me, Egg. I haven't... Speaking of it being beautiful, I played it on my laptop, and I had to play it in a very small resolution on the worst graphics. So now that I actually have a, a good PC, maybe it'll be a more enjoyable experience. 
Is Quillback one of the early shopkeepers that grew a full beard and made a coat out of horned lizards and groundhogs? Maybe. Although, I think the patch notes call him the caveman boss, so... Maybe he's just like a... A giant caveman. Or maybe he's, yeah, maybe he's the father of the caveman. Then who's the mother? Who's the one that gives birth to the caveman? Oh, this is a tide pool. Let's look for a crab guy. Tusk? That's nasty. That's real nasty. Hey, I'm not poisoned yet. That guy's alive. Maybe Quillback is the mother? Hey! Could be. Does it ever say if it's a... Explicitly, it's a male? Yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't use any, like, pronouns. It says the leader of the caveman, a big bully, who wears the pelt of the last cave porcupine. Look up bear traps. All right. Uh, the slightest pressure will cause its powerful steel jaws to snap shut, causing massive damage. Also, it doesn't show you your deaths by the traps. Which I find weird, since you die from the traps a lot. Uh, totem Trap, Quillback built these to train his followers, although they mostly serve to put them to sleep. Okay. Good detective work, Plip. Oh, okay. That works. Picked up a parachute somewhere. That guy would have sniped us. Yeah, I don't see any crab dudes. Hey, Mr. Daplier. Hey game toaster, um, this is the daily, we went Volcana Temple, and we're trying to get over 50 HP and over a million, which was requested, so Animus Major. Yeah, Hero, I've, I've uh, been playing Boshi, well, I've been playing fan games, so I played the first, I want to be the guy, and then I've... I'm like 65%, 70% of the way through Bashi, but the bosses in that game are so brutal that I have to, like, I'll play one day and then I'll have to take a couple days off. Um, after Bashi, though, I'm excited to play some better fan games, maybe without bosses that are soul-sucking, soul-crushing. 
Uh, I beat Mega Man, though. We're on the boss after that. Well, I think the difference between... Or, I think the difference with Dark Souls is... The bosses actually look fun to fight. Hey, Void Mother, thank you for the gift sub to Clammy. I appreciate the support. Dark Souls difficulty is insanely overstated. I've always kind of wondered that, like how hard it really is. Although I think it will be really hard for me because I just don't play a lot of like 3D games in general or uh, third person shooter games, third person games. Uh, there's, yeah, so I've I've actually been planning on making like a spreadsheet with games and suggestions and like show the games that I've played or have interest playing on stream. Since people ask a lot and, you know, not everyone can be there when I say which games I've played or am interested in playing on stream. Wolf, don't do it to me. <laughs> I like it though. Good attempt. I appreciate the effort. Hey, Risk. Yeah, you're not too late. I just. I started extra early today. Earlier than I usually do. And I also started the daily earlier in the stream, but it is one of those slow ones. Because I haven't finished a daily in a long time. I've been trying these weird challenges that usually end up killing us. Is probably still hopping around on the top. Don't feel bad using bombs in the temple. Not one bit. We are still at 90 HP. There it is. Oops. As long as they're useful bombs, I don't feel bad using them. I missed. Did they get rid of mummies in the Cosmic Ocean? No, it, they just 
have a small chance of spawning. Like, they don't spawn on every temple level. Not a small chance, but it's... Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know what the odds are, but... One-fourth spawn rate, yeah. I was going to guess that, something around there. I have played Super Meat Boy, one of my all-time favorite platformers. Totally. That's actually part of the reason, or a big reason, why I have, like, um, auto-run off, is because I was just so used to using the run button in Super Meat Boy. So every time I'm running, I'm, like, actually holding the button, or holding the trigger down. Oh, don't do that. Oh. You know, I think if I didn't have pace there, I wouldn't have died because my uh, bomb would have hit the witch doctor. Maybe. If I aimed it correctly. Well, at least we killed him, right? Hey, Pikachu. I still have 30 levels to get over 50 HP, so... That shouldn't be an issue. Assuming we don't die, I mean. Oh. Oh. Let's not go over there then. Hey, thank you for the 69 bits, Anonymous. Yeah, that's true, Void Mother. I do something similar to that, but I mean, I guess it's, I guess it's the same as using push to walk. It's just you do the opposite action, you let go of the walk button. I don't know. It seems weird to do push to walk. But then again, you're running like ninety percent of the time in this game, so. There's definitely a reason why it's on there by default. have enough HP to withstand an explosion just yet. I think it's cool Vlad's cape also affects the critters. Nice little touch. I don't think we even need a mummy. We still have quite a few levels to go. Oh! Okay. Misjudged where the jellyfish would come from. 
Yeah. Do people do no sprint runs? I've seen a couple of people attempt those. I've tried one or two, but... You know, it wasn't too hard in the first game, but this game has a lot of... Um, it's a lot more cramped. It's kind of crazy how open the first game was. Exactly, Darker Turbo. You know, I haven't attempted that in a long time. But it, it's not... I think it's a fun challenge. I have played Mega Man 11. I think I've beaten two or three stages. Two or three bosses. Um, like I was saying earlier, I haven't played Baba as you. But it looks fun. And any plans on streaming Super Meat Boy forever? Probably once it comes to Steam, I will. Alright, let's take the jungle level slow. Scout the door before we die to a witch doctor again. Ormu, thank you for the three months. Mandatory celebratory message. Hamter. Hamter. They have changed the ending, Coco. There are now little asteroids that you can break with your spaceship. Pretty cool. Uh, let's not get destroyed by the mosquitoes. Oh, yeah. Rye Tides, those are for the normal runs. I always do the daily, though. And on this daily, specifically, we're just going slow. I guess I should add and daily to my challenge, or and daily to my title. Ah, this guy, though. I think he's pretty much trapped in there. Don't do it. Okay. We have plenty of resources. No reason to be skimpy. There's just a croc man in the loop, so I'm not going that way. I'm trying not to. Oh. Okay. Wouldn't be surprised if we died here. No crockmen. Oh, 
Thanks, Lava. Have you played Portal 2? Yes. Oh, I guess when I was talking about the puzzle games, I did finish Portal and Portal 2. Okay. Fun daily, I guess. That's what happens when there's a uh, small ice caves level. You'd think I'd have uh, learned by now to whip UFOs and then run away. <laughs> 